Hi everybody, my name is Stephanie Stosky. I'm the Certified Sommelier with Rollers Wine and Spirits, and I'm here today to talk about some pairings. We are entering holiday season where we all will probably be eating some delicious foods and hopefully enjoying some delicious wine with those. Um, so I've chosen some wines that will take their place on, on my table potentially. We're starting with the Oysterman. This is a Muscadet from the Loire Valley of France. It is a collaboration between Casey Davison of Toadfish Outfitters and Frederick Horaher, both are Charleston residents. And they are donating money back to replenish the oyster beds in the low country. For every bottle sold, 10 square feet of oyster bed will be replanted. Very important to me. I spend a lot of time on the water here, and so that keeps our low country waters fresh. This wine I chose for the Feast of Seven Fishes. If you happen to be participating in that tradition, goes with anything seafood um, and also great for oyster roast, clam bakes. It is um, um, shellfish season in the low country, so perfect for those occasions. Next, I chose a rosé to pair with pork or ham that might be found on some of our tables this holiday season. This is by Mary Taylor. We had the privilege of meeting her a couple months ago via Zoom, of course, and I absolutely loved her. She's been working for a couple decades with European wines and has fallen in love with the how, how each region has a sense of place or terroir. So she developed her line based on that, yes, which confuses most Americans she built her business on. But this is 100% Gamay, will go great with that saltiness in your ham. Next, I'm going for my personal turkey wine. This is a Gamay, it's by Jolie Laid. I love the fruit forwardness, it's so juicy. Uh, makes your mouth water to kind of contradict that potentially dry turkey, hopefully not. Um, but it is so beautiful on your table as well as he chose, chooses to feature a different artist on each vintage. So this artist is Kate Scott featured this year and I love, um, love the labels on this wine. Finishing off with the classic pairing, I know I'll have some, some beef on my table this holiday season. So this is Carnero Springs Cabernet Sauvignon. If there's a silver lining to COVID, this is it. Um, we've had some great vintages with a plethora of fruit in Napa, but then COVID hit and some of the Napa wineries weren't able to make it through that fruit. So they then sell it off to confidential wine wineries and they bottle it under a different label. So this is one of those wines we've tested ourselves blindly against some wines three times the price and absolutely loved it. It is bang for your buck for sure. And hopefully you have some curiosity about all of these wines. And if so, then you can come in and we, this is one of the flights we are featuring this holiday season. Um, this is our holiday flight, so you can come in. They're presented beautifully, great gift. Other flights include the Bubbles box, um, the Natural box, the hashtag Napa Strong box, box, which will feature wineries that had some destruction in the Napa fires of this year, and then the Lady box that celebrates all of the female winemakers. So if you're interested in those, Come in and check us out. We'd love to see you here at Rollers.